Virtual production is a technique combining real-time digital elements to physical production. Emphasis on real-time because it has to be iterative and collaborative on set. This could be something as simple as a track camera, motion capture, or something as rich and complex as a large LED volume running a photorealistic environment. Hey everyone, my name's Addy. I'm the Vice President of Virtual Production at Disguise. We're on a mission to democratize this incredible technology for all of the storytellers out there in the world. Virtual production is gaining ground right now because it's the right time for a lot of key technologies to merge at the same time. Things like real-time rendering with Unreal Engine, LED display technology, GPU power, and so on. And most importantly, the successful adoption of virtual production in mainstream media, shows like The Mandalorian. The three benefits to virtual production are one, the ability to bring any actor into an environment built for imagination, or it could be a replica of the real thing. Two, the ability to perform camera moves that are difficult or next to near impossible. Three, keep the entire production crew where you need them and cut back on most of your location filming and travel. Some of the challenges that virtual production solves is when you're using traditional green screen shooting with post-production, VFX is typically very expensive and it's not something that's easily iterative. Now using IC VFX or in-camera VFX, you can get that shot delivered much closer to the finish line. Some VFX is still needed, but at least you can eliminate a lot of it. Now in the past, the actors have had to fill in a lot of imaginative gaps in green screen setting. In an LED volume, they're surrounded by the environment in which they're acting in. It helps with a much more natural performance. When using virtual production, filmmakers should take the following into consideration that it's not a magic bullet, it's not gonna replace every shot. It's an incredibly powerful tool set in your storytelling arsenal. Virtual production works best when there's a lot of pre-planning up front, such as previs and tech -fiz. The benefit is that your overall production is faster and more cost-effective, and you iterate less in post. Virtual production is also an iterative tool set where you can make creative decisions on the fly, sometimes during the shoot. This guys creates a seamless workflow by not only powering the entire stage, but also giving you a central point of control over the entire technology. Now you can make creative and technical changes at this point. You can make changes to the content, the lighting, the cameras, lenses, or you can scale up and down the rendering power, reconfigure your tiles and so on. Virtual production will usher in a new era of film by giving you more established workflows. Right now we have car processing and window processing, which are pretty standard in the industry. And over time, we're gonna have more and more of those. And these are just gonna be more tool sets for the creative to tell their story. If you wanna get started as a filmmaker in virtual production, you can call your friends, come visit a stage, or attend one of the many educational events that are happening now. Disguise is offering a beginner to advanced training program as well as documentation to support productions. You can also learn Unreal Engine and start to play around and create the worlds you want to make. It's actually not as difficult as you think.